Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Peace, blessings, and mercy of God be upon you. This is another presentation from www.central-mos.com and from the Humble Heart YouTube channel about the 29th of June 2020 Karachi Stock Exchange terrorist attack report. You are well aware of the Chinese incursion into India in Ladakh, what the Indian military terms as its western sector the all-weather indian supply route to subsector north and haji ghulam rasul galdwan valley has been cut off by the chinese the indian dbo airstrip which is the only other way to supply indian army has been compromised at bottleneck ladakh it was inevitable that the indians will perform a terrorist attack in pakistan because the indian military can neither fight nor counter the pakistani or the chinese at the battlefield so we had it today at karachi so karachi is the seventh largest city by population and the fourth most densely populated city in the world the stock exchange which you see here is in one of the busy parts of the city terrorist attacks in dense urban centers are the most deadly and the most difficult to counter as you've seen that many like in mumbai india last for hours and hours the this entire terrorist attack were wrapped up in eight minutes with three casualties let's piece together what happened so the terrorists they arrived at the security gate at 1002 in a car at the barrier private security guards here asked for ids and the first security guard is shot dead the terrorists get out of the car and start shooting. The second security guard takes six bullets to his chest and also passes away. The on-duty police is also killed a little later. Inna lillahi wa inna ilayhi raji'oon. This is Iftikhar Wahid. He was a private security guard who challenged the terrorists at the gate and asked for IDs and he was killed. He was 60 years old two days away from his retirement. His pay was 18,000 Pakistani rupees or roughly 107 US dollars a month. He has five children. The oldest son has Down syndrome and his disability, unable to speak and unable to walk. This is the second security guard, Khudayar, 60 years old. He took over when his colleague was killed and he took six bullets to the chest you need to understand that these are not soldiers or the police but security guards at the gate to check id cards neither of these 60 year old men backed down then came the police sub-inspector shahid ali who led from the front and also became shaheed while resisting the terrorists within minutes the rats or the rangers anti-terrorist squad which is the police but with the armed unit arrived at the scene and finished the whole scene in eight minutes killing all four terrorists with single shots to the head and the stock exchange was opened back up for business in 20 minutes this is not the army or the special forces but armed response unit of sindh police constable khalil here shot at the terrorist who was trying to take the pin out of his grenade with a single shot i don't have that picture in this presentation because i know families and children watch this but you will see that basically the, the terrorist his fingers is halfway stuck in the pin and he shot him dead with a single shot his partner muhammad rafiq also killed a terrorist who was trying to escape in the alley with a single shot to the head the terrorist organization has released pictures of four terrorists and what you see here and here in the background are pictures of imran khan and head of pakistan army on the targets which they were using for practice here you see grenades and extra rounds which the terrorists carried with them so here's a video how the rats prepare to counter urban terrorism day in and day out everything from the vehicles to how they seat to how they react is specific and designed to take out terrorists as quickly and with the least loss of life in a dense city setting so the rats actually move in specially designed vehicles and it's a team of eight rats in a single vehicle 
So what you see is the driver and his partner in the front, and they carry AK-47s in the front. This guy is a spotter, so there's nothing here. So what you see, if you need to take something out, he's got his one foot sticking out, and you will watch in a second how they aim and shoot down on a, from a moving vehicle. Next maneuver, what they see is what you saw today in Karachi in uh, some of the TV channels. So basically, what they have to do in this point is dismount and take. So this is dismount and all eight go and take eight positions around the car. So they basically cover the entire parameter of a terrorist operation. Everything from, from the vehicle, the way they dismount, the way they're trained, they do this every single day again and again and again for this one operation that you saw come together. So he's covering the flanks, as you can see. This guy is covering the rear, just in case if there's a rear attack and there's another team. So they basically, they have mirror arrangements on either side. And this is what you saw come together, which led to the successful anti-terrorism operation in Karachi unfolding within eight minutes. Jazakallah khairan. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.